There gang, D. Tidwell, Enduro MTB Training. So, I ah, had a great time out there in EWS up in Aspen Snowmass. Uh, stoked on my results. But what I want to talk to you about today is, um, well, just quick, quick little video on how to uh, how to take care of yourself after a week of racing. So, what I did was I took a couple glorious days off from training on Monday, Tuesday, because we had long practice sessions on Thursday, Friday, and then we raced hard Saturday, Sunday. Uh, and with that little get off I had, uh, I ended up with um, some road rash on my left shoulder, my little elbow's a little sore. So got some minor stuff to deal with, but so I took my two days off, uh, did some hot tubbing, and just kind of relaxed. Um, so today, what I focused on was where do I need to get some help? Um, and that's what I would encourage you to think about um, after long rides or a long race weekend. Um, where does your body need help? So uh, today I discovered after going through a quick kind of reintroductory workout <clears throat> just to open the body up again, um, did some light bike, some good specific stretching that, that I need on a regular basis for my body, um, some light foam rolling and lacrosse and ball and stick work uh, in certain areas um, that I need. and. Um, and then I did some primal movement patterns. I did some squatting, um, three sets of squats. I did about uh, 60 lunges around the track, body weight. Um, I did some, some moderately heavy cable pulls. Um, I did some BOSU push-ups, and I did some band work for my shoulders uh, and my scapula, uh, just to get some blood into that shoulder that was a little sore. Did a few sets of front squats, and let's see, what else? Um, yeah, and then just finished with a little bit of a cool down. Um, and so what I discovered is my elbow hurts more than I thought. Um, so what I'm gonna use is, is my team. So I'm gonna call my chiropractor here in a bit. I'm also gonna call my physical therapist. So my chiropractor is gonna help me with my neck because when I crashed, uh, the first thing that I noticed in that second was a loud bunch of cracks in my neck. Uh, when I was getting up from my crash, I was like, oh, my neck hurts. So I'm going to go see my chiropractor, make sure my neck is good. I'm also going to make sure my pelvis is properly in line. And then uh, also go see my physical therapist to get some dry needle trigger point therapy in my elbow. Uh, and maybe even some of my shoulder. Um, so that my body is ready for next week uh, to get back into the normal training plan. Where I'll be strength training again in preparation for Big Mountain Enduro Steamboat coming up in a couple weeks. So... Think about that kind of stuff as it relates to letting your body heal and then begin fixing it, preparing it for training and stress again. Um, you also want to make sure that you're hydrated during this time, that uh, you've eaten well, clean, good food, um, post-race or post-long ride weekend, uh, just to really help your body uh, recuperate. I'm not sure about you, but um, last couple of days, it's fun to watch the body heal because um, during those couple days, um, my body began to grow, my, my, my muscular system adapted or was becoming, uh, was adapting to the stress of the four days. So my muscles were growing again um, because they were being broken down during those four days. So they were healing, they were growing again. Um, I could feel it. Uh, and then um, I was hungry like all oh, get out for the last two days. So I was eating a lot as well. So catch up, you know, not catch up, but just, you know, really try to cue in on those cues of, Hey, my body needs a lot of nutrition right now to help me recover. Um, even taking some extra, you know, fish oil, a little extra good fat to help my joints uh, as well. So, just a little quick video on some ideas that you can do to help yourself um, recover uh, post big time stress, whether it's a race or a long ride or a tour or something like that, some kind of good event. Um, so, hope to, hopefully, you can use those and uh, use your team. Always use your team to help you uh, to operate uh, at your highest athletic level. Uh, so there you go. Give us a shout if we can ever help. Info at EnduroMTBTraining.com. And um, hope your summer is going well. Man, can you believe it's already August? <gasps> anyway, uh, 
you guys have a good one and um, holler if we can help in any way and uh, keep keep her up on two wheels we'll see you soon and uh, pay us a visit over at our Facebook page say hi and uh, Instagram at Enduro MTB training for both all right see you guys bye bye